welcome to another video. Today I thought it would be really lovely to show you a bit of a behind the scenes of a photo shoot day. So I shoot with Georgia who has become a really lovely friend and we always have the loveliest afternoons together. So I thought it would just be really nice to show you what we get up to. We are shooting some outfits today out and about around London, well mainly around like Notting Hill area. Um, and I'm incorporating a combination of vintage pieces that I have bought and some new things as well. I absolutely love vintage shopping. I find it so exciting going into a shop and not knowing what you're going to find, what you're going to come out with. So I've incorporated some really beautiful pieces that I have found recently as well as a couple of new bits. So I'm going to show you how I style those outfits. And I feel like now that we're going into autumn as well, it will be really interesting to see a few of the outfits that I'm wearing right now and how I style them. So hopefully you'll enjoy it. First outfit, I'm going to try on this gorgeous slip dress. I've never worn this before. This is a 1930s vintage slip that I found in Brighton. Brighton is full of the most amazing vintage shops. And I just absolutely fell in love with this when I saw it. I've actually been on the hunt for a slip dress. So I couldn't believe it when I found this one. And because we're obviously going for like autumn vibes, I'm going to layer it with this jumper. This is from Rouge, and I am a massive fan of Rouge. Um, it's a French brand, completely chic, as you can imagine, and I just feel like that jumper with the slip will look really nice. The only thing is, I was a bit worried that just having the jumper straight over the slip like this would make it a bit like baggy and it won't sit that well. But Georgia has given me the best <laughs> tip <laughs> to add a belt to the slip dress, and it'll be completely hidden, and then you can like tuck the jumper in. So I'm going to give that a go and hopefully that will look better. And then in terms of shoes, I was going to go for like these pointed heeled boots. So that might still look nice. I'm going to try them on. But I might also give it a go with some Vidra trainers. Just going to see how it goes. And then based on what shoes I go for, I'll decide what bag to go for. So outfit number one, I've obviously got the slip dress on. And I paired it with these boots that are actually really old now from Karen Millen. And I've had them for years and they are so, so comfortable. I wear them so much. And I actually love how this looks with the jumper. It just adds that like autumnal vibe. I feel really comfortable. And I do have the belt on underneath. So I've literally just put the belt on around my waist, tucked it in and then folded the jumper over so it's, you can't see that it's there. And I just feel like it sits a lot nicer. And then my bag is actually also by Karen Millen. Again, it's, I've had it for years, but I just feel like it's such a good staple to have in the wardrobe. I just wear it with everything. Now for jewellery. So I'm going to be wearing Majuri. Now Majuri is all about having fine jewellery for every single day. So rather than wearing your fine luxury jewellery just for special occasions, this is actually the kind that you can wear on a day-to-day -day basis. And all of the gemstones and diamonds are ethically sourced. So it's just a brand that I really admire. So I'm going to see what I feel like would go really nicely with what I'm wearing. I definitely love these earrings. I think I'm just going to wear these for all of the outfits because they are just so classic. So they've got the very dainty hoop there. So I'm definitely going to be wearing those. And then I really, really love these rings here. So that one I think is so delicate and gorgeous. It's got the little diamonds around the outside. And then this one I'm so, so excited about. This one just goes on your little pinky finger. How cute is that? Absolutely love that. That's such a great just day-to-day -day ring. So I feel like those two together. And now for necklace, hmm. I feel like maybe this one, that's really dainty and pretty. So this one that I've chosen is actually a choker. So, oh, it looks so delicate and pretty there on its own. Oh, so lovely. I do feel like I could add another one though, because it is, a choker so this one is slightly longer just check which way it goes there we go and i quite like layering my jewelry there we go gorgeous oh i love those two together really pretty so now that i'm ready we're going to pop up get some photos of this outfit and then we'll move on to the second one
Outfit number one complete, and I'm here with Georgia. Woo! <laughs> you walked into the house. <laughs> that would actually be something you would do as well. It would. <laughs> So for the next outfit, I am going to be wearing this top that I am obsessed with. You've probably seen me wear this already uh, because I just feel like it is my favourite top at the moment. This is also by Rouge. You can tell I'm a massive, massive fan of them. So I'm going to be pairing that with some jeans. Now I found these jeans on Etsy, secondhand vintage, and they're by Replay. And no joke, they are like the best fitting jeans I think I've ever worn. And bearing in mind I bought them online on Etsy, I'd never tried them on, it was a complete gamble. And I've just been wearing them non-stop. And I feel like these kind of jeans are a must for autumn and winter, I can just obviously wear them with everything. So I've got that, and then on the back I've hooked this little bag, which I actually don't think I've used, but I've actually had it for a while. This is by Melly Bianco, and it's vegan leather. So I'm really excited to see how that looks with, with that. It's kind of like, you know, I love that look of baggy jeans, a really nice kind of sexy top, little clutch bag. I love that look. And then obviously because the evenings are getting colder, I thought I would pair it with this knitted jacket. This is actually by Dior. Now this is a loan, it's not mine. And I'm a massive fan of renting clothing. My favorite rental company is called Her, H-U-R-R. And they have the most amazing pieces of clothing that you can rent for a couple of days or even a week if you're going on holiday or even just for a night. Um, so I definitely recommend her in London. So outfit number two, I just love this top. I feel really good in this top. I feel super comfortable, but I feel like it's like the right amount of sexiness. And then the jeans, I absolutely adore. I have just been wearing these non-stop. So I've added little scrappy heels with them. I just really like the jeans with heels. I obviously wear them with trainers as well, most of the time. Um, but for this outfit, I feel like it's a nice dinner evening outfit, like going to meet some friends. And then for the jacket, the thing with the jacket with this is this is kind of like bulging it. So what I'm gonna do is, if I just pop this on, I'm going to undo this and then just like tuck it in. And then that just means that it will sit flat. And then if I wanted to, I can do this up. And this jacket is like one of the classic tailored Dior jackets that they do that are absolutely stunning. But it's in knit this season, so I love it. I think that's a really nice outfit for the evening. And then I've also got the bag. So that's the outfit. Let's have a look at the jewellery again. So I've kept the little pinky ring on because I don't think I'm going to take that off. <laughs> just absolutely love that. And then there's that one. Again, just very, very simple. And that goes really nicely with the bag that I have. So we've got all of the gold going on. And for the rest, I'm going to go for this. This is the sun necklace. I love how delicate the jewellery is by Majuri. There we go. I think that looks nice with the top. So I'm going to open the jacket because I do really like it just like that. We've actually decided to stay in the flat and shoot because I do think it looks really, really nice. We're going to make the most of it and it saves us like popping in and out the whole time. Um, so we're just thinking of using this corner over here. I'm going to wear this beautiful little lace top. I adore this. You just tie it up at the front there and at the bottom. And I'm actually going to keep wearing these jeans because that's just how I've been wearing this top. I just think it looks so, so cute with it. And for shoes, I'm going to wear just little pink sandals. They're these ones. I've had these ones forever. They're actually, I think from River Island. And I think I've had them for like 10 years or something, um, but they just go with everything. So that's going to be the top. And for the bag, I have got this little bag that I wear almost every single day. This is my go-to every single day bag. It's by Pop and Suki. That's my name on the bottom. <laughs> Not that you ever really see it because it just sits on the side. So really, really simple for the next outfit, keeping the jeans. So I've got the outfit on. I just really like this. I feel really good in this. I feel confident. And I actually really like it with the sandals as well. 
and the bag just makes it all super super casual with the jeans. For Majuri jewellery, I still kept the pinky ring on because I'm just not going to take it off. I'm going to wear this really delicate necklace. So it's got tiny little diamonds just all the way around the outside. And I feel like this is the perfect length of necklace for the top that I'm wearing as well. It would just sit really, really nicely. So, so delicate. I love how this jewellery, it feels like it is super luxury. It is fine jewellery, but it's definitely the kind of thing that I would love to wear just on a day-to-day -day basis. And then there's also a bracelet here that's really pretty, actually. All of the jewellery is very, very delicate. So this one's super easy to put on because it's just got the little ties. So you just pull them together, tighten it. There we go. Five little beads. We're going to head out now to shoot this outfit and also grab a little coffee, maybe a bite to eat. We never have a day where there isn't food involved. I'm always like, time for snacks, time for lunch. Um, so we're just gonna go for a little wonder. How gorgeous is the sun, making the most of it. We've come to a little place called Bluebells. The sun is so, so hot. I've got my little, what are they called? Like crushes or something. <laughs> I've actually gone matching with my top. Pink and pink, baby. I'm so happy with that place because the waiter just gave me two free vegan croissants. Well, actually one each, but you're not Sorry, interested. I, I did the kind thing and passed it on. <laughs> I will love you forever, honestly. <laughs> I'm gonna go back there all the time. This is how I win repeat business. <laughs> it works. I hope you liked those three outfits that I have styled for this season change. Although it really doesn't feel like we are going into autumn. Today has actually been so, so warm. It feels like we're in summer again. But I really love just combining the vintage and the newer items, especially from Rouge. I just feel like it's such a chic, French brand and then styling the jewellery as well that I just think is so delicate and pretty. And make sure you check out the description box for the links to all of the jewellery by Majuri and everything I'm wearing as well. So thanks so much for watching and I will see you soon.